Welcome everyone. Let's talk, guys. Let's see what messages we got. But a collective. This is an all sign read. So take what resonates. Don't try to force things to resonate with you guys. Okay. Take what applies and then leave the rest. Ooh. All right. So we got somebody saying, look, we need to let each other go. All right. So maybe you could be into it with somebody. So let's see what else. I replay our conversations over and over. Okay. Maybe this person here who they really truly were from you as well. You didn't find out who this person truly was until after the breakup. But this person is saying, look, maybe we need to let each other go. But they're replaying this conversation that you had with them over and over again. Like y'all last conversation, they keep replaying it over and over and over again in their head. I wish I could share my good news with you. Okay, well, it looks like somebody, I, I got here at the bottom. I left when I saw you with someone. So maybe, I don't know who walked away from the connection. Could have been you or them. But somebody walked away from this connection because they were dealing with somebody else. But this person still says they love you unconditionally. And they say, well, maybe one day we will be back together again. But they feel like right now, maybe the best thing is for you to let each other go. But they still thinking about this. This is replaying over and over and over again in their head. They just constantly keep lit, just constantly keep being reminded of something that was said. Okay, something that you said to them, conversation that y'all last had. Let's see what went wrong. got some jumpers all right it looks like you intimidated them they didn't see a point in stand because you had like you didn't need them okay so you intimidated this person and it looks like y'all couldn't never agree or be on the same page agree to disagree like that's it was constant arguing and just not being able to come to a common ground but this person felt like you were very much so intimidating okay they felt that you pointed fingers at them for everything And then we got no longer happy. It's not the same anymore. So this person feels like things just aren't the same. Like you don't need them no more. Like they don't know where they fit in when it comes to a connection with you. As they say, it's just not the same. It's not the same vibe. It's not the same energy. They're not getting, not feeling the same vibe like how they used to. Let's um let's get some romance angels. All right, show me how this person feels. What's going on with this person? Show me what's going on with this person. Show me their energy. All right, so we got heart-to-heart -heart conversation, and then we got let your friends help you. So they're talking to their friends, getting information from their friends you know, on what they should do when it comes to this connection. Um, they're, they're really, like, leaning and depending on their support system. It looks like their support system is their friends on what they should do with the connection. Yeah, see, we got free yourself. 
some of y'all walked away. We got it's time to take back control of your life. But with free yourself, this masculine or divine feminine, it could go either way. Somebody is deciding, look, it's time for me to free myself. And they're making some type of effort. They're still trying to be optimistic when it comes to their love life. They're still trying to stay optimistic. But they say, look, we got to let go of each other. We just holding on to each other, trying to control each other when really we could be free. Okay, we could be free to love and do whatever we want. All right, but this person still has feelings for you, okay, regardless of the fact. This person still has romantic feelings for you. We got your feelings are real and worth exploring. Ooh, okay, that just flew out. We got getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Okay, so it looks like over time, it looks like y'all going to have to get to know each other all over again. There is going to have to be a sense of forgiving and learning lessons here. But it, it looks like y'all going to have to learn each other all over again. So it looks like there's a break period of you taking some time to yourself, freeing yourself, learning new things. Okay, dealing with other people. Um, and not necessarily sexually or romantically, but just being more open to something new. Okay. Then it looks like y'all will get to know each other again. Like maybe y'all come back together and, you know, forgive each other at a later date because the attraction is still there. And it seems like this person is trying to call, is going to be trying to call you back in. Okay. So, oh yeah, it, it is going to happen very soon. So this person ain't even going to be gone for that long. They going to be calling you right back in very soon, okay? So, yeah, that's what I got, guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Oh, yeah, if guys, if you're interested in booking a personal reading, I am doing new client specials. I'm running a special. Um, I'm not going to keep this opportunity open because I had an overflow um, the past couple of weeks. And I just want to do a certain amount of people. So once I reach my certain amount, guys, I'm sorry. You're going to have to wait till we're back open, okay, doing personal readings. But right now, I am open to personal readings, all right? The information to contact me via email is going to be in the com not in the comment section, but um, the description box below, okay? All right, so until next time, guys, ciao for now.